Connecticut is fighting back against a federal lawsuit filed against the state's ban on assault weapons. The suit was filed by the National Association for Gun Rights and is one of five lawsuits filed in different states, including Massachusetts, Illinois, and Hawaii. The association calls these bans on assault weapons and high-capacity magazines unconstitutional. Connecticut's Attorney General William Tong disagrees. After Sandy Hook, we passed the strongest gun laws in the nation. And that happened in 2013. I was part of the team in the legislature that did that. And those gun laws, including the assault weapons ban, the Sandy Hook laws were challenged. And in 2016, the United States Court of Appeals for the Second Circuit said that those laws are eminently constitutional. And the Supreme Court declined to hear the case at that time because presumably they knew that these laws are eminently constitutional. And so that's why you don't see a challenge and haven't seen a challenge. And that's why it takes someone from out of state to try to come in here and send us backwards um, and put these weapons back on our streets. But we're not going to have it. We're going to stop them. We're going to win this case. Attorney General Tong says he will be talking to and working with the attorneys general in the other sued states to fight for the current gun laws, saying that our state's ban is lawful and strongly supported by the vast majority of people across the state. Now, governor Ned Lamont also responding to the federal lawsuit. The governor saying in part, we will not allow these common sense laws that are preventing violent crime to be eliminated. When it comes to the safety of the people of our state, we must stand up and do what is right.